I will be reciting an excerpt from Macbeth, Act 2, Scene 1. I am Mateen Lomax. Is this a dagger which I see before me? The handle toward my hand? Come, let me clutch thee. I have thee not, and yet I see thee still. Art thou not fatal vision, sensible of feeling as to sight? Or art thou but a dagger of the mind, a false creation proceeding from the heat-oppressed brain? I see thee yet, in form as palpable as this which now I draw. Thou marshalst me the way I was going, and such an instrument I was to use. Oh, my eyes are made fools of the other senses, but it's worth all the rest. I see thee still, and on thy blade and dudgeon gout's blood, which was not so before. Ah, oh, there is no such thing. It's bloody business which informs us to mine eye. Now over one half world nature seems dead, and wicked dreams abuse the curtain in sleep. Witchcraft celebrates pale Hecate's offerings, and withered murder, alarmed by a sentinel wolf, whose house is watched thus with a stealthy pace. With Tarkin's ravishing strides moves towards his design like a ghost. O oh, sure and firm said earth, hear not my steps, which way they walk, for fear the very stones prick my whereabouts, and take the present horror from the time, which now suits with it. Whilst I threat, he lives, words to the heat of deeds too cold breath gives. I go, it is done, the bell invites me. Hear it not, Duncan, for it is a knell that summons thee to heaven, or to hell. Thank you. So before we start, I'm just going to give a little bit of background for my poem. If you've seen the show called Full House, that's what my poem is about. So, also, my name is Carter Flory, and the poem is called Full House. <laughs> Full House. House full of men. Danny, Jesse, Joe, father, uncle, friend. Uncle Jesse, whose hair is never messy. Watch the hair. Have <laughs> On Uncle Jesse. Three men raising three girls, or the girls raising them. Wake up, San Francisco, Denny Tanner screams through the TV screen. His three girls watch for themselves. No women in this house, this house full of men. DJ Tanner, oh my Lanza, Stephanie, how are you? <laughs> Little Michelle, you got it, dude. <laughs> One day, DJ listens to the radio. Be the ninth caller, he says. And win two free tickets to a Beach Boys concert. The men downstairs leap for the phone. Oh, a groan. There's a voice on the line, and it stammers. Uh, hello, this is DJ Tanner. Just named his Beach Boys song, DJ. And the tickets are yours. As the strains of Help Me Rhonda Blair, EJ stares. <laughs> Help me, Gabler, she says, turning to Kenny Gabler, the neighbor. Help us in silence. She does her no favor. Pressure mounting, 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 time ticking. Help me. Who? Rhonda! Shout the men. The men of this full house. And the men become boys. Beach boys. <laughs> As they go to the show where they sing, Kokomo, Kokomo, that's where I want to go to get away from it all. From what? From this male dominated world, this three story house. This house full of men. As we sit on the bed and get patted on the head, our sins we confess and learn a life lesson from the men, the men of this full house. 
this house full of men. Cut it out. <laughs> Um, my name is William Horlocker, and I'll be performing a poem called I'm Stronger, and um, it was written by me. So. That kid that you pushed in the hall and ignored how he had no friends at all? <laughs> well, he's asking himself what he did to deserve this. Well, maybe because he looks a little different on the surface, or maybe it's the way he acts, or the crazy fact that his dad passed away last May from a heart attack. Well. He already feels alone and confused, and to top it off, he goes to school and gets abused. Well, now you're wondering how extraordinary the kid really is. Because you see how upset the vice principal is. Well, you don't know why, but think about it terminally. How the kid may have went to sleep permanently. Well, now you can do is wonder how to turn the frown upside down, and maybe encourage all the other kids how suicide is not an option that exists. <laughs> 